Next up, we can import uh, cameras into Unity directly from our digital content creation tools. And it'd be qu pretty handy if we want to turn this inspect bot into maybe some kind of first person camera that's inspecting the hole so we can actually see it from our game view. So how would we do that? Well, if we switch over to Maya in this case, we've created a spline, which our which is driving the animation of our inspector bot here. Um, and I've got a number of keyframes, so he f follows it along there, um, like so. But importantly, we ha we want to attach a camera to that. So again, I've previously gone create camera, uh, but actually in this case, you can see he's attached. Uh, and this camera has the uh, settings over in the attribute editor. Um, in this particular instance, it's an angle of view of 73.74. That's obviously been dragged around, but we might want to use focal length, um, something like a 24 mil or maybe a 20 mil. That goes for lights too, so cameras and lights can be animated. Um, but in this case, because it's parented to uh, a spline, we want to actually bake out the animation. So if we're to select uh, the objects we want to export, then again we do the export selection and we're going to call this um, cam bot in this case. Um, again it's important to include cameras uh, and then under animation we're going to make those keyframes like so by checking the box um, and then we can pop that into the project like so. We get a short warning to show that it's baked the curves out of that. And then when we switch back into Unity, we have a new camera bot, which includes, as you can see, attached to it, a Unity camera with all of the parameters and components that you expect from a camera and matching the parameters that we set. So in this case, field of view rather than uh, focal point, but that's uh, equivalent. And if we um, have a look at the animation side of that, we want to enable the animator for this uh, imported camera. Uh, and the way we would do that, the animator is already applied to, uh, as a component because it's detected uh, an animation, but we need to create an animator controller for this. So we will go, first things first, we want to uh, remove the camera in the scene that's already there and use the new one uh, and then we need to create a let's create a animator controller and we'll call it cam bot like so and then in the animator we can literally drag in the animation clip from the camera bot and then we enable that on the game object so we want to select the new cam bot uh, animator controller, then hopefully when we push play now, our camera view is controlled, uh, or rather our game view is controlled by the motion of the camera that we've exported that's parented to the inspection bot. So we have two of those guys, one illuminating the side of the ship and one um, circulating the ship that we have exported from Maya in this case.